I'm Erin Bonafidi, and I'm a graduate student in the Department of Psychology at the College of Rockport. Um, my advisor and I are looking at post-traumatic growth, uh, which is if you have trauma, people have usually looked at the, the negative aspects of trauma, the major depressive disorder or the post-traumatic stress disorder, but you can also have a lot of growth from trauma. So we're looking at post-traumatic growth in uh, LGBT individuals regarding the coming out experience where they come out as lesbian and gay. And we're actually looking at that across the spectrum of age. So somebody who's 20 years old and coming out now versus somebody who's 60 years old and coming out now. So how much trauma they have and how much growth that they can have from that as well. Right now, um, we're again, we're still working on the hypotheses, um, but we're thinking that the more trauma you have, the more growth you're going to have. Um, and we're also going to be looking at if you came out 20 years ago, it could have been a much more traumatic experience versus if you came out six months ago, it could have been a way less traumatic experience. So we're looking at you know the spectrum of age, we're looking at the spectrum of trauma and how much growth you're gonna be having. So we think that older individuals will have more trauma if they came out 20 years ago when it was, you know, it could have been illegal. It could have been, you know, way harder to deal with something like that. I really liked the professors. The class sizes seem small. The people are great. Um, it's close to Rochester, so you got that. Um, but the, the professors are, are wonderful. My advisor has been just amazing. She, she meets with me every week, and half the time I come in and I'm all flustered and going, Dr. Eckliff, I've got so much stuff going on. And she goes, okay, calm down. <laughs> Tell me what's going on. So we're, you know, she's my advisor, but she's also, you know, very supportive. She's, she's a good friend. <laughs> a lot of studying. <laughs> a lot of late nights in the library. Um, but I really like all the people that are in my program. It's a very small program. There's only about nine of us, and we've really gotten to know, know each other well. We're all very good friends. We've gone out for drinks a couple of times. We've had some late night study sessions when we're all kind of freaking out about stats or psychopathology, and um, I've just gained a group of close friends that I think is going to carry me through life. You know, I, I feel like I can call any one of them at two in the morning and say, oh my God, I have this question, help me here. And I really, really like that experience. 